Hello everyone and welcome to another video from Now Trin Tech. And in this video, I am going to download and I am going to install Audacity in Windows 11. So I'll leave a link to the download page in the description under the video. So when you hover your mouse over the download tab, there are some options here. You can download for Windows, you can download it for Mac and Linux. So these are the recommended downloads, the latest version of Audacity and the latest version is this one on top, Audacity 3.2.1. It's a 64-bit installer. You also have the zip file and they have another version here which is the 32-bit installer and zip file. So you want to install the latest version which is 3.2.1, 64-bit installer. So I'm going to click on the installer, the 64-bit installer. So you're going to get a prompt that says, do you want to allow this app to make changes to your device? You want to select yes. There's a drop down tab with the different languages. You can select whichever language you would like. I am going to select English, click OK, click Next. Now this is a free software, click Next. It's going to be installed in the program files folder slash audacity it says at least 66.4 megabytes of free disk space is required click next you want to check this one create a desktop shortcut so it will place an icon in a desktop click next click install and it's installing you can read this click next so there's a checkbox here. If you want to launch Audacity, just leave it a check. As you can see, it created an icon here. Click Finish. Click OK. So you can check this box. Don't show this again at startup. Click OK. So this is Audacity and it's a free program and it has a lot of great features. With this software, you can record your voice. You can save it as an MP3. You can edit that MP3. So there's the pause button, there's play, there's stop, there's forward, there's backward, and there's a record button. So to record in Audacity, you just need to click on the record button here. Test in one, two, three, test in one, two, three. This is Audacity and you can press pause. So if you want to pause the recording, all you have to do is click on pause and to continue recording, just click on the pause button again. Test in one, two, three, test in one, two, three. And when you're done, just click on stop and the entire recording stop. So to save this recording in MP3, just go to click on file, export, export as MP3. You can also export it as a WAV file and OGG. So I'm just going to select export as MP3. And you can save it on your desktop and type a name for it. Click save. You get this. You want to just click OK. You can also play back this audio just by hitting the play button here. I'll minimize this. So here is the MP3 audio and I can just click on it and play it. It's Test gonna open one, two, three. Test. in my VLC media player. So I hope this video was helpful to you. I thank you for watching and I thank you for subscribing.